Hello, I'm Vidhi and I'm also known as Ramen Head Girl. Recently, my favorite cousin moved to the UK to study biotechnology and even though she's going to ace it in the lab, she's never set foot in the kitchen. And there's only so many instant noodle packets you can eat, right? So Preeti, you genius, this one's for you. I'm going to show you three easy recipes that even you can make. Add some salt and pepper salt. So for the first recipe, I'm going to show you a really quick one pan pasta where all you need to do is add all the ingredients to a pan, dump it all together, add some water, some salt and pepper and you'll be done. So in my version of the pasta, I am adding some tomatoes, onions, some zucchini and some mushrooms but you can add whatever you like. So the best thing about this recipe is that it gets done in under 10 to 15 minutes. You just need, it's literally just one pot, that's it. Going to add some basil leaves for some freshness. Don't forget the garlic. And finally, some salt and pepper. So students come home really late and I know they don't have a lot of time on their hands. So when they're doing their other chores, this is perfect to make because you don't need supervision for this. Finally, we have all the ingredients in the pot. We're going to just shut this, turn on the flame and I'm going to go read a book till then. So Preeti, since you love pasta so much, this literally just took 10 minutes to make. And it's gonna taste fab. This is so good, you have to make it. So for this next recipe, we're doing a masala pav bhaji toast. It's not as easy as a one pot pasta, but it definitely is still very doable. So for this, we're going to take some boiled aloo, I've mashed it up right here. And to this, we're going to add the rest of the ingredients. So we have some tomatoes, we have some peppers, some onions. So basically everything that goes into a pav bhaji without actually having to make the pav bhaji. We have some coriander. And now we're going to add the masalas. So the basics, we have some red chilli powder. Of course, the pav bhaji masala because you cannot without this. And the last, some garam masala. Finally, we're going to add a squeeze of lemon to this. And now all you need to do is mix it up. So for the next bit, what you're going to do is take a slice of bread, add a little bit of water to it so that the aloo sticks and then you're going to put the potato on top of it. It's as simple as putting butter on bread, but in this case, you're putting aloo. And this is done. So Preeti, you better make all your friends in the UK try this. You're going to be the life of the party. So Preeti, for the last one, I'm going to show you how to make a vegetable and rice stew soup situation. And I know you're only going to rely on fast food there, but this one is fast, it's food and it's healthy. So let's go. Preeti, you will definitely want to cuddle in and watch a movie now. That's exactly what I'm going to do as well. So Preeti, before you go crazy on your grocery shopping, don't forget to get the Neo Global card and then swipe, swipe, swipe. 